Hey guys, I'm Isabella. If this is your first time seeing my face, hi. And if it's not, welcome back. Why did I? Well, today I got creative really late at night and wanted to do some makeup, but not your normal makeup look, more like an Insta filter or Snapchat filter. I've been seeing a lot of the cloud filters lately and I said, why don't I turn that into a makeup look? And I found some on Pinterest. So I guess we can begin. So I want to try something like this. I just looked it up on Pinterest. I don't know who exactly this is, but love the makeup. So we are going to try that. Okay, so we're gonna first start with our base and if I'm being honest I don't wear base makeup ever um, foundation concealer contour one because I don't really think I need it and two I don't know how to use it <laughs> if I'm being honest with you so I'm just gonna take the max studio fix powder plus foundation and the shade c5 just have an even base I don't prime one, I don't have one, and two, I'm not leaving the house, so I'll just take it off immediately. I don't think, yeah, you guys could see, I'm peeling on my nose for like the past two days, and I don't understand why. I just went to tan today, but that's basically it. Okay, so once that's done, I guess, should we start on the eyes? Yeah, we will start on the eyes. Oh, the two palettes, that, that's four, but God, the same two P sides. Okay, <laughs> the two palettes I'll be using is the Morphe um, James Charles collaboration and the 35B Morphe palette. These are old. Um, well, the James is obviously obviously about to be a year old um but this one i think is two or three i don't believe in expiration dates as long as they work that's all that matters now to prime my lids i'm using the urban decay primer potion someone that i've been watching a lot of is um what's her face amanda bb i think that's her name she does like her makeup and rants about a topic and i just love her Holy cow, I love her so much. So I'll be taking this shade in the 35B. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my finger and then use this shade in the James Charles palette. I don't have the names, sorry, but it's the gold one on the top left. So right now I'm going to explain what I'm doing since I did not in the video, but right now I'm making the shapes of the clouds using the primer I used on my lids. Now I'm gonna take the white shade in James James Charles palette. Oh my god, this is where it, it can all go wrong. Okay, I'm using this brush. This is a Morphe brush. Yeah, it's a Morphe brush. I don't. It's like the flat tip one.
as long as it looks decent on camera and in pictures that's all that matters okay so now i'm adding like these little horizontal theme jigs so now he made it like a blush so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna take a little bit of that same peach color or we actually this one so the one i originally used was this shade right here the one i'm going to use for the blush is this i might just take the peach again and just shade around the clouds Take that blush, I also say peach, pink, and maybe shade it out, blend it out. That looks cute. That looks cute. I just add a little bit more white so you guys can actually see it. The white, even though you can't, but like just add a little bit more. I'm using the white from the 35B palette now. Now I'm using the Nicole Guerrero Anastasia Beverly Hills highlighting palette. This is, I broke it like a while back. That was my favorite shade, but that's okay. Um, they don't sell this anymore, sadly. But false. I I just checked Sephora last night for fun, and I saw that they brought it back. So if you guys are interested on in purchasing the the highlighter palette, I would I will leave the link down below so you guys can go check it out and purchase it yourself but i'm just taking a pink highlighter oh, kitty cat this shade sorry my sister's friends are over but <laughs> this shade kitty cat and i'm using the fan brush Go or glow getter. I mean, some of you guys might actually have this palette, but I'm just taking the gold highlighter and I'm putting it on my nose. Here I am using the Burnt Bees Hydrating Lip Oil in the fragrance or flavor, not really sure. It's passion fruit. I'm using the KKW Beauty Mascara. I forgot to put highlighter on my Cupid's bow. Okay, so I just wore this pink long sleeve v-neck sweater. <laughs> um, I thrifted this, but anyway. Now we are finished. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it to the end of the video, please leave a like if you guys like these makeup videos because my friends always ask me to make them. So this is my first one and I decided to be a little bit on the more creative side of things rather than a basic makeup look. But if that's what you guys want, please let me know. And yeah, again, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. We're almost at 200 subscribers, and I would really appreciate it if we, if we made 200 right before my birthday or on my birthday, which is May 2nd. But yeah, I will... Uh, <laughs> I can't speak. I will catch you guys in the next one.